For our next video, we're going to focus on Travis Kelsey for our Chiefs player series. We are going to start with the face shape. We're going to use a letter U to start our face shape for Travis Kelsey. So once we get our U shape to make the jawline for his face, what I do is in the middle, at the bottom part of my U, I draw myself a little horizontal line. And then on the sides where the U comes up, I make straighter vertical lines and I try to keep them the same so that they start at the same spot and they end at the same spot. And then from here, I'm going to connect with a diagonal line. So I'm gonna connect from here down to the middle. And I'm going to do the same over here. And it's okay if you wanna make this a little, the chin a little bit bigger. And then from there, you can kind of just curve those edges so they're not so pointy. And now we have the start of Travis Kelsey's cartoon face. From here, let's go ahead and add the nose. So you can add a little bit of a curve or you can use the letter L. Either way will be just fine. So here, if you wanna use the letter L, I would fit it right before the um, like cheeks, right before you curve down. So in that middle top area. And then we're gonna add these little C's for the nostrils. So let's use a backwards letter C. And then on the other side, we're gonna use a regular letter C. And that just helps give some realistic qualities to our cartoon. The next part, we're gonna focus on the beard. So let's start with the mustache part right underneath the nose. So under the nose, we're gonna add a horizontal line. And underneath that, we'll add two diagonal lines on either side. Let's go ahead and add the second line. We're gonna repeat these exact same lines for the opening for the mouth. So repeat those exact same lines, just it'll be a little smaller since it's inside. Let's work on connecting the top part of the beard. So here we're going to add a second and shorter vertical line for the sideburn. And we're gonna stop because the beard is gonna angle up. So we're gonna come here from our mustache and we're gonna use a diagonal line to connect to that shorter vertical line. And we're gonna repeat that step on the other side. So it's helpful to start and stop in about the same place. And then we're gonna angle up with a diagonal line. So there we have this top part of our beard. Next, we're going to reverse those three lines for the bottom part. That way we can fit the mouth. So we're just going to reverse this two diagonal lines down and a horizontal line. For the top lip, we're gonna use the letter M. And for the bottom lip, we're just gonna use a slight curve or a little smile line. And we'll use those letter C's again for the edges of the, or the corners of the mouth. Okay, 
Let's add the sunglasses for Travis Kelsey. Let's start with the connecting the nose bridge of the sunglasses over the nose. And I'm going to go up just a little bit higher than that. And from where I stopped, I'm going to make a horizontal line all the way to the beard or the sideburn. And instead of just making a square, I'm gonna take the sides of the sunglasses in just a little bit. But you can use a square, you can use a circle or an oval, whatever works best for you. So with this, the idea of a square, I'm going to have the sides come angle in just a little bit, angle in. And that will make the bottom a little smaller than the top. I'll repeat that again on the other side. So we're gonna go all the way to the sideburn. And I'm gonna angle in just a little bit on each side. So it's almost like a square, but the bottom is a little shorter. And there we have glasses for Travis Kelsey. Let's add his ears. We're gonna use a letter C and we're gonna start close to the top of the sunglasses and stop at the bottom of the nose. So a letter C on one side and a backwards letter C on the other. Now, Kelsey has earrings, so let's add those. And we're gonna just add a letter C. So start at the bottom of the earlobe and add a little letter C. And a backwards letter C for the earrings. Let's move on to the hat. First things first, we're gonna connect the top part of the face with a little bit of a smile line. So we're gonna start low and then we're gonna go up just a little bit and come back down to the other side, okay? And then for the top, we could add lines like we're making a rectangle and continue that same shape. We're gonna repeat the same line Go up in the middle and come back down on the sides. If you wanna make it look like the hat is going around the head, all I did was use a slight curve to meet the back of the head in between the ear. And we'll repeat that on the other side. Now we're gonna focus on the top part of the hat. And this is almost like a rainbow but you don't have to make it perfect because it's a beanie, right? And that doesn't mean that it sits perfectly on top. It might be a little bit more flat instead of round. And then you can add these little lines for a pom-pom on top. And if you like, you can add the letters K, C in the middle of that. To finish up, let's add two vertical lines underneath the chin coming down. And then we're gonna make the um, neckline for the Chief's jersey and we'll add a letter V. And then use a candy cane like line to finish the neckline of the jersey. Let's use two diagonal lines down for the shoulders. And you don't have to, you can leave it just like this with the jersey or if you wanna add his um, fancy jacket from the Super Bowl parade last year, what you'll do 
is add a big triangle, kind of like a suit jacket. And we're gonna make the V a little bit bigger. So we're gonna start here um, on the outside of the neckline and we're gonna make a big V. And then we're gonna turn it into triangles. So we're wanting, we'll add a little line on down. So we're gonna start here at a point like a triangle. So we want the ends here on the shoulder to be bigger. So we're gonna start close together and come out. So that way it's a bigger like lapel. Make a point and come out. And there you have it, Travis Kelsey. And you can color this however you want, like to. Make sure to use the red and gold for our favorite chiefs. Have fun.